Hello everyone, photographer Andre Designs here with a new how-to video and today I'm going to show you guys how to add two logos to one image. Alright, sometimes people may have um, done an event and you want to put the event logo on the image or you have two logos for your business and you want to put two logo on one image. I'm going to show you guys how to do that today. We're going to do it inside of Lightroom, but we're going to have to use Photoshop first. So let's get right to it. So first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to go over here to uh photoshop these are my two logos that i'll be using today and what you want to do first is to put the image or one of your images inside of lightroom or well not inside of lightroom inside of photoshop and just get the dimension and create the logo all right so what we're going to do right now is to come over here to my folder and i'm going to um i think let me check here i think i have good all right, so I'm going to bring a horizontal image inside of um, Photoshop. Good. So let me just remove this logo from here real quick. Shift backspace and remove that. Good. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring this logo over here. Let me press V for the move tool. And I'm going to put this right there. Then I'm going to um, Alt T and pull this up like that this is my wedding logo i'm gonna put it right there all right then i'm gonna come over here to my photography logo i'm gonna drag it over and place it right there alt t or command t and bring it over to this side so this is how i want the logo to look if you want to put it on top of the logo you uh, on top of this one you can any way you want to do it but this is how i want to do it right now all right good so what we want to do now, we want to remove the background. So this eye right here, we're going to click it to remove the background. And then we're going to save this as we could go to export and we could say export as. And then we could come here to PNG, ensure that this is, this is on PNG. And then we're just going to say export. I am going to export this to the desktop. So I'm going to call this two logos. Logos. Good press enter save so now this is saved on the desktop i'm just going to minimize this and then i'm going to come over here to lightroom right all right so in lightroom we have one two three four images here vertical and horizontal images right so what we want to do we want to put the logo on the horizontal and then we want to put them on the vertical we cannot mix them we just have to do one or the other all right so for the vertical images i'm going to press export and then I'm going to scroll down to where it says logos. And then I'm going to edit. And then I'm going to make the selection for the logo that we have created. Right? I think I put it on the desktop. Right, right here. Good. So we click on this. Good. So right there, as you can see on the screen, it's now showing um, two logos right here. Sometimes you may go in and you're not seeing the logos at all. What you want to do is to ensure that your opacity is at um well your uh what's they call this again yeah opacity is at a hundred percent because sometimes it's at zero put it at a hundred percent and you want to ensure that the anchor is in the center right here all right if you're not using two logo you want to put it at the left or you want to put it at the right or if you want to put it in the center anyway you want to do it so we're going to put this in the center here down at the bottom and then we're going to stretch this so it fills the sides just like that you don't want to bring it way up to the end here you just want to ensure that it's in the line like that good then we're going to click save and we're going to name this logos let's just say logos all right um good we're going to click create and then we're going to find a folder we're going to choose where i want to put it so i'm going to put it on my desktop i'm going to call this youtube images and then I'm going to click create because that's where I want to put the images, right? So I'm going to click choose and then I'm going to click export. So now I'm going to go to the desktop and I'm going to search for that folder. This is not a desktop, so desktop and look for YouTube images. Good. So if you look right here, you will see, let me bring this up. You will see two logos. It's that easy. For the vertical image, I'm going to do the same thing. So I'm going to come here. I'm going to click on the vertical. If you're only doing one logo and 
either side you do not have to select the vertical separate from the um, horizontal all right so i'm going to select these two then i'm going to click export and then i want it to export to the same folder right so i'm going to scroll down here to logos i'm going to click on edit um under watermark and then i'm going to come here choose and i'm going to go to desktop and i'm going to select the one that says two logos good so now we see that this cannot work on the vertical um image because it was created for a um, horizontal image what we want to do is to grab the sides and pull them in like that good then we're going to click on save and we could call this v2 logos so it means vertical two logos i keep spelling logos oh i already have it all right good i'm gonna create and then um export and then i'm gonna go back to the desktop and i'm gonna check for this vertical one here bring this up and good as you can see there there's two um logos here on the image so it's that easy so you have it saved right there now so anytime you have um if anytime you need to upload two image uh two logos on an image you have it saved inside of lightroom very easy thank you guys for watching i hope you learned something new and stay tuned for another video next week bye bye